First baseman Alex Terrell and center fielder Tony Jenkins. Questions to the players. Guys, Guys, just the, the, the offensive output. Obviously, to get a score for him run before, but to have a night like this where you jump on him early, talk about that a little bit. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, we have uh, been working extra hard, you know, especially in this off season, especially with our offensive side of the team. I know that that's supposed to be our strength, but that's something we take a lot of pride in. You know, coming out here early and staying late. So you know, it's, it's good to see it pay off. How about you getting the first home run right this yeah. season after that great, you know? Right. Yeah, that, that was great, you know, finally get that one off my chest, you know. It's always, you know, glad to when you hit one out, but that first one, you know, just means a little more. Were you wondering about, let you, were you frustrated at all last, this past weekend, even though you guys swept? No, uh, I don't like to look at really much, you know, a bunch of my personal accolades over the weekend. You know, if I'm, my team wins, obviously, you know, I did good enough to, you know, put my team in a, in a position to succeed, and as long as that keeps happening, I'm going to be a happy man. For sure. And, yeah. Tony, you you had your first one this season too, right? Right, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Talk about that that play and. Right. Uh, no, it's definitely a, a great feeling to to hit a home run, of course. But you know, we've been working really hard and in practice and like Terrell said in the off season. So it's finally good to see everything starting to pay off. Obviously, you guys don't care about the rankings till the end of the year when when it matters. But to move up to number one this early. Does it put a spot on your face, like, hey, we, people recognize what we have here as this team, or do you not think about it at all? Yeah, for sure, it puts uh, something to our name. I mean, when everyone's coming, you know, here we're going somewhere else, and they know they're playing number one Miami. It's just, hey, if we beat them, that's a, that's an edge that we got for ourselves, you know. So everybody's coming at us with their best, and you know, there's nowhere that you could go from one but down. So it also, you know, puts us out of position that we gotta, you know, keep grinding and we gotta keep doing what we gotta do to stay there. Does it? You know, put any more pressure on you guys? You no. Nah. Nah, I, I think that I think that's that's something that we don't try to worry about here. I feel like you know all the things that we went through in the off season and you know in our fall training. You know that that pressure you, you don't you don't feel any of it. Uh. And what about you? No, no, I completely agree with Terrell said. Uh, <clears throat> you know, it's it's all good being number one, and you know you got got to stay focused, keep working hard, and uh, keep you know pl winning games and you know doing what we do. So. Obviously, everyone's going to be excited about this weekend uh, series coming up. Number one, number two. You know, the Gators have kind of been a thorn in your guys' side for a while now. How motivated are you going into this weekend? <laughs> Can't wait. Uh, it's definitely the juice is going to be flowing uh, this weekend. Um, rivalry game, of course. Uh, like you said, we're one and they're two, so it's going to be a lot, a lot this weekend. But hey, we, you know, we're ready for it. We've been preparing for it, so. Just take it from there. Tony, what's the, what's the atmosphere like here when the Gators come? Oh, it's gonna be crazy. I, I, I think it's sold out already. So mm -hmm. the whole weekend. So the, what's crazy? Just the fans, of uh -huh. course. Yeah, the what's fans. Um, can't describe it. I can't. I can't really describe playing playing in this atmosphere. It's it's unbelievable. Uh -huh. um, I'm just I'm just excited. I'm ready to go. So. It's it's kind of loud, isn't it? Oh, of course, of course. And they, 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 there, there will be a lot of Gators fans, probably. Oh, I'm sure, for do, sure. Do you, do you thrive on that? Do you like that? Uh, yeah, yeah. Sometimes. Somewhat, yeah. Alex, same questions for you. What, what, what do you think about the Gator series coming up? You guys have not had in the last several years. Haven't done well against them. Uh, I feel like we played them well last year. Uh, we went in Gainesville and we played in hostile environment. You know, mm -hmm. like you were speaking about and. I think I think we played a good series. You know, we kind of let them off the hook there on Saturday. We should have. I think we should have came out on top, but uh, things don't always work out. But I feel like, you know, it's the Gators and, and the Canes. You know, it's just that type of environment that everyone wants to be at. That's why we're gonna have a sold out crowd here, and it's just that Florida rivalry. Everyone's excited to get out there, and we're just gonna be exchanging blows back and forth all weekend. What, what was it? You were here, yeah, when they came here, right? The first year. What What was that like? Can you explain that atmosphere? For people who don't know. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you got a lot of noise coming out of the crowd, and it's something that really gives you the chills, you know, when, when you get a big hit or, you know, you just get announced to the plate, you're like, hey, I'm, I'm really here, you know, I'm, I'm living out my goals, I'm living out my dream, and, you know, I'm here against, you know, against the Gators. Do you guys know players on that team? Yes. Have you played with them? Yeah, uh, I had a few guys on my summer team for them. Uh, and you know what? It's it's all love, you know, outside the fields, but once we step in those lines, like I said, we're, we're going to be going back at it with each other, so. 
It's just business. What about exactly. you, Tony? Do you know any guys? Yes, I do. Uh, yeah, I played with a couple, a uh, couple of them, you know, growing up and stuff like that. So it's gonna be fun and a good time, you know, seeing them uh, before the game and talking to them and and everything. But like Charles said, you know, once seven o'clock hits, it's time to go. So. Yeah, well, I have question they the rivalry between Florida and UF and UM how is it different from the rivalry other than one's ACC one's SEC and FSU I feel like there's no difference you know it's, it goes back from before we were even born it's just you know two of those Florida schools going you know head to head and it's going to be a competitive battle and we're all looking forward to it and Tony Difference between FSU and UF because I know they're big folks. Yeah, yeah, like you said, uh, there's really no difference. Uh, you know, all we're all Florida schools, of course. So, <clears throat> I mean, I, I guess having that title and you know being able to beat those guys and whatever, uh, it's gonna be most important. I feel like so. I'm just kind of curious this season for you. I know it's only a few games in, but just kind of how you're feeling on the plate overall and uh, seeing you make plays in the. Outfield there, alumni game things. Just how you're feeling? Uh, so. I mean, I feel great. Um, the fourth game right now, so uh, you know, still have a long season ahead of us. But uh, you know, just been working really hard. Uh, you know, in the cages, you know, defensively, and just finally, I feel like I'm starting to see things pay off. So you got to keep pushing. Anything else for the players? All right. What, yeah, I have one more. What in, uh, this series, as far as just national status and whatever the ones coming up and getting a win in this series what, what does that do for the program uh i don't i don't feel like you know it's going to mean a lot because you know like i said it's a big rivalry game but what's going to matter is you know if we line up with them in omaha or if we line up with them you know in the playoffs that's when it's going to matter right now we just got to go out there and take care of business agreed it's great all right, All right. thank you appreciate it guys.